did you, did you, friends, Sunday, I just did a little video, my Sunday video this morning, or this afternoon, man, it is, friends, oh, here comes this freaking animal, he's a little dog, he stands about, hmm, maybe 10, 11 inches high, he a little fuzzy bugger, looks like Benji, but about, <laughs> he's small. But he just comes running up to you and he just starts barking right in your face, like literally at your feet. You know what I mean? Like how pleasant is that? Who taught that dog to do that? You know? <laughs> hey, um, wow. My last couple, of, hey Blaze, buddy, listen. Hey, I'll tell you something right now, right, right in your face. You're you're good at that stuff, that that milling and man, oh man, you know you, you you're a talented guy. I I, you know, when we get doing stuff, you know, we like I like my tree work. I love my drumming. I love other stuff like rock work. I used to do a ton of rock work before I got busted up, and uh, digging in the dirt, and like you know what I mean. I just you're a similar guy, and I really like what you what you're gonna do. I, I think those Lelandi hedges, those are enough to kick somebody right in a nutsack. That, that, that stuff's, it's no fun. It, it is no fun. 20 years ago, yeah, right buddy? <laughs> you know what I mean? I hear you. So good on you, bud. Good focus. I love it. And thanks for the kind words, pal. Blaze. <laughs> I love it. I said my wife. She goes, Blaze. I like that name, Blaze. And you are a Blaze, buddy. You are. And don't ever forget it. You Blaze at whatever you do. So, but I like what you're talking about. That would I dibble and dabble in, in my in my live edge stuff like, like yourself. Nowhere near what you're doing. But I I just it's something that 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 I uh, I I really get enjoyment out of. I mean, to to take a tree down and to turn it in. Like I got a couple of pieces in my house that I actually you know cut the tree down. And, 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 you know, it's like that old thing. I want to buy a piece of property and cut the logs down and build a log cabin, man. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, <laughs> you know what I mean? It's that old dream, eh? The American dream. Canadian dream, really, in this matter. Um, yeah. So, I had a ton more to say, friends, on the video. But it just, it was going to end up really long. And I've got gardening to do. I've got some other stuff to do. Like, me and Blaze were just telling you all about all these things we got to do. Wow. So, but I don't, I want to, uh, it, it is gorgeous out right now. It's freaking gorgeous. Joe, you guys hear me talk about Neon Joe. I call him Neon Joe. It's Joe's Neon. Listen, any of my subscribers, if you have not gone over and subscribed to, to, to Joe's Neon, please do. He's, 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 he just edited his first video. Uh, I didn't realize he had somebody editing his videos. But the man, like, I like real people, okay? I like real people. People with heart, with passion. Uh, people who get dirty and roll around in the trenches. That's my kind of person. I just, I, I can't, I, you know what? I don't. I love human beings. I love everyone. I do. I love the human being. But as far as surrounding myself with people, I do like to surround myself with people who have like things. Like I don't hang out with anyone, to be quite honest with you. I hang out with my family, Chester, you know, my power saws, Victor is about the only guy because we work together but I hang out with my wife and my two kids and they're not even here ever they're getting older so I hang out with you guys <laughs> I do you know so I don't really I've got lots of friends but but you know what I'm saying friends you know what I'm saying so Joe's neon okay the man he did this video the freaking guy was out in his backwoods peeling mushrooms off a tree I just I want to support this guy, friends. I, I I do. I want to support him. Can you can you can you help me do this? I I don't ask much people, from from you guys. I I, I don't ask for much, but I really would like to to support Joe. Uh, 
and there's and there's there's one other fella at this present time that that I I would like to see because he's a talented bugger, he's a really talented bugger, and it's uh, Killinger. He's uh, he's a crafty guy. He he does axes as well. You know what I mean? And he does leather work. Him and Joe are friends. But 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 I gotta tell you something. These guys are working men. Okay, we've all got jobs. Uh, they're they're easy to watch. They're easy to watch. Joe is Joe is super cool to watch. They're totally different characters, eh? Like uh, Killinger, he's kind of uh, his sense of humor is way different than Joe's. Way different than Joe's. But but friends, I want to make a point of um, of of doing shout outs now and again for 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 channels because you know Logger Wade did that for me. Mr. August Haneke did that for me. Uh, you know, and I've done it. I've done it all the way through my, my, my short time here on YouTube, but, but I really, really want to support Joe, uh, uh, Joe's, Joe's Neon. So I would so appreciate it if, if, if any of my subscribers would just go take a peek over at Joe's. He's got lots to offer. Uh, uh, lots. And Killinger as well. Just Killinger, just like it sounds. He's a good guy. These these guys are my friends outside of, of YouTube. We're we're miles and miles away, but we communicate on the phone and we text and and we're we're new friends. You know what I mean? So I think the community's awesome that way. So I'm gonna show you my little three-legged dog here for a minute, okay? So friends, before I get on to something else, Joe's neon. Let's 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 go support Joe. Let's see if we can get his subs moving a little bit for him. I I, I really want to. This, this would mean a lot. And for Killinger as well. Okay, friends? Thank you so much. Come here, you guy. Oh, she's so skittish. She's so special. She's so special, this dog. But you can imagine what she's had. People trying to grab at her and, and just, you know what I mean? Like, it's... She's mellowing. She's mellowing. Her mom... It's her and Rita and mom are really tight right now. I think men... It's, it's a little bit different around men. And that's a theme sometimes with some of these dogs. I think men maybe have been... But she's so beautiful, friends. She's so beautiful. Chica! Chica! She sure knows that. Chica! Chica! Chica, come! Chica! Come, Bob! Come on, Chica! No. Not gonna happen. Okay, so, anyways. I'm gonna try and make another little video for Sunday for you guys. Um, just because, like, I had a whole bunch of other footage. But it was a shorter video. Like, I've been putting out a freaking ton of content. Hey, what the... Blaze, what did you say there? You 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 check me out somewhere's social something? What do you mean? I don't I don't I don't. What's that? I don't know what you're talking about. Anyways, um, peppers. I got to build a little hut for these peppers. So I got to I'm gonna make a mini greenhouse a greenhouse for them. A little mini greenhouse. Um, there's lots to do right now. So, uh, there was one other thing I wanted to, uh, yeah, it'll come to me. I'll get back to you in a minute. Over now, friends. Thanks again, everybody. And be kind. Whoa, lost you there. Hey, so, uh, friends, I was thinking about counting how many axes I've actually made to date. I hope that light's not in our face. To date. And, uh, I, I, <laughs> this is crazy. It's about 150. It is. It's about 150 axes. Since I started, which I think was August last year. July, maybe July, August, maybe September, somewhere there. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. Thank you all so, so much. I love when you guys get your axes and do videos. I love it. If you haven't seen Richard Payne uh, Landscapes, the English boys, my buddies opening their axe video, the unboxing, Go check them out. Listen, I wasn't finished talking about Joe's Neon. Friends, Joe edited his first video the other day. <laughs> he did. I didn't realize he wasn't doing it. Well, he just edited his first video. He did it years ago, I think. And that's what attracted me to Joe, the rawness of that, eh? Listen, what I'm saying, get, get, Let's go over and see Joe and give him a sub, friends. Can we do that? If anybody's watching my videos right now 
and and it's Sunday video. If you haven't subscribed to Neon Joe, Joe's Neon, pardon me, it's Joe's Neon. Friends, go over and see this guy. He's got a heart of gold. He's sincere. He's he's just he's engaged. Do you know what I mean? And he actually cares. He does. He cares. That's why I like Joe. You know what I mean? He's he's been on YouTube a long time, but I I just I like him, and I'd like to see his channel. I'd like to see people over there. You know what I mean? Can we do that, friends? Let let let's go give Joe a sub, and 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 he's part of this community big time. He's in the comments all the time, and he's just a great guy. So so I uh, like I say I I don't uh, uh, you know shout out too many channels and say go check this guy out or whatever, but Joe's. I co-sign Joe all day long. I really like Joe. And Killinger's another guy. Killinger's, a, he's an ax man and a leather man and he does all kinds of stuff. And he's one of my new friends too. Uh, and if you want to watch some nice ax builds and a great sense of humor, the guy's got a great sense of humor. He's funny. He's got chickens running around and stuff. Killinger's a good guy too. And, uh, you know, I'm just talking like this because I know people that follow my channel, um, these are friends of mine outside of YouTube. I mean, yes, YouTube, that's where I've met them. But we talk on text, we talk on phone calls. And these guys are great guys. They are all working men like myself who, who, who have a passion for doing this stuff and sharing their stuff with people. Really, that's what it is. So, uh, Killinger, that's the name of his channel. Go see him too. These are guys are two of my friends. Hey, yeah, and of course, Dick or Dave. You, you got to have a Dick or Dave in your life. <laughs> Dickard's awesome. We all know this. So I'm not on a big channel shout out, but uh, while I'm doing this, uh, listen. The barefooted uh, double bit chick. Hey, what's her name? Have you seen her? She flicks out double. She does the flick technique. You want to learn the flick technique? Go over and see the barefooted splitting wood girl. Yeah, she does the flick technique too. She's excellent at it. Excellent at it. Excellent at it. Excellent at it. Excellent. No, that wasn't a an editing thing. That was actually me doing that. Okay, God, I've probably got a thousand things I wanted to talk about. So I've just thought about one. So let's talk about it. See this, friends? See all this here? See these? These are all axes. <clears throat> They're all axes. You know what I mean? So here's the deal. Claude, Cloud, Claude. Um, Brent Lamison, we've spoken. I've spoken with all you people. Um, Blaze, Darren, you, you guys are getting shipped this week. Uh, Darren, you are. Um, Slumdog, we've spoken. Okay. Um, sorry. Friends, uh, Larry Warren, we dealt with you. Anthony, Anthony John, buddy, you're you're a smart guy. I'll tell you why. Because if you're going, if you're going here, this 28 inch axe here, buddy, wicked. It's going to be wicked. I love this build, and the handles are great. Hey, check out my belt buckle. I'm in a good mood today. Well, I'm in a great mood today. So, yeah. Oh, now I want to talk to my my axe friends. Now, tell me if I'm on the right. Mike Holmes, Michael. Just a minute. I've been wanting to talk to you about this for a while. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Here it is, right here. Mike Horner, buddy. You see what I'm holding in my hand right now? You said all-purpose 32-inch pitted and unique is what I've got written down in your column, my friend. I'm telling you, uh, Michael, and I know that it's not Michael that's getting the axe. I think it's his, it's his buddy. Listen, friends. This axe, bucking special, dark dark handle it's got it, it this axe friends is um 
it's stupendous. Okay, it is really cool. It's it's I would think by the looks of the pole, I think it's a GBA. I, I honestly do. I think it's a GBA Grand Force. Grand Force. I do. You you'll never find it because of, of this pitting. Isn't that deadly though? Look at it, friends. I'm still gonna have one more really intense look for a logo on it. I don't know if I'll find it, but I thought that for you, when you said unique and pitted and stuff like that. I, so when you watch this video, if you do, please uh, email me and just say yay. And it's getting wrapped up and sent to you. Okay, bud. So friends, I've got axes made. Okay. So there's also a couple of beauties on the 28 inch handle here. Friends, it's, it's more about time and all those kinds of things to get it all lined up to ship. So there's a bunch ready to go shipping now too. My last shipping bill was $742. That's correct. So, yeah, yeah. I just wanted to go through that. So John Cook, uh, we're coming up. These are names we're coming up on. Actually, Shane, Shane old boy. I'm gonna show you something, Shane. Buddy. Okay, talk about a Sunday video. Look at that stinking thing. Listen to that bird, did you hear that? <laughs> Shane, you got a really, really cool ax. I haven't put any wedges in her yet. I may do. Gosh, this is a nice fit. Oh, somebody drilled the back of the ax out. You can see it right there, see it? It's minuscule. Anyway, yeah, you, you, I told you HB and you, and I got one more of these heads. I got one more. Yeah. Okay. So, so friends, the axes, don't, you know, they're, they're here. It's a time thing. And plus I like doing the vodka to them and letting them hang around and testing them on all that. So we're, we're doing pretty good on the, on the, um, sorry. Oh, this is another crazy ax. Gosh, darn it. I think that might be, uh. Oh no, I better not say. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm kind of losing it because I'm all swarmed in axes here and I get all excited around the axes. Uh, but I just wanted, so so there's been, uh, oh, Crystal Lingren. Crystal Lingren. I can just go back in emails and find out what style of axe. I don't have anything written for you down. It was probably nuts around that time. I didn't write anything down, double, single, 32, 20. Can you refresh my memory, please, Crystal? John Cook. Charles, we got going. Warren Dean. Warren Dean, did we not send you an axe already? <laughs> Todd Drew. Jared Drew, pardon me. Matt Holmes, Michael Campus, or yeah, uh, Washburn, Ryan. So we're creeping down on these now, friends. So I, I guess I guess it's just important, friends, that you know that the axes don't come in a hop, skippity, pop, jumpity after you freaking order them, okay? They don't. They take time. And friends, remember. Remember this. It's very important to understand this. I have a job. I work for a living. And when axes come and go like a perpetual thing here now. So, you know, if, if, if you're in a hurry for your axe, I have a couple gentlemen that I, that I, I deal with if you want to buy an axe from someone else if you're in a hurry for one i can line that up for you and there, we all know who they are but 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 they they may take an order but but as far as my axes go uh i i don't get pressured i i, I can't have being pressured about my axe about your axe um you know it, it it's just what it is it can't be rushed it's not one of those things because I can have something all of a sudden, because um, you have stipulated, everybody has, they've said certain things they want. So when an ax, little group five, six, seven, eight axes come in, I go, ah, there's that head I was looking for, for so-and-so. And I call you and say, I got your head. Do you know what I mean, friends? It's this type of scenario. But the end product just ends up being like, friends, I haven't had one. You know, it's, this has been really fun for me. This has been really, really fun for me, this axe program. Okay, friends, I'm rambling too much now. I have to go. I actually, what I've been working on here is I've been working on my last, my very last 
um, handle, my very last hickory handle here. And it is coming up very nice. I work it like a freaking caveman. It's coming. It's got a long way to go, but it's coming. And it's for Al, our friend Al. But Al, there was a, I found an issue with that plum head. I think it's a crack. I'm going to inspect it a little more, but I've got this other one here for you. Oh, who else was I talking? I like talking to you guys like this because it's simple. It saves me emailing and all that stuff, me and you guys doing that. We're going to do it after this for sure, or texting or whatever we're doing. But, uh, excuse me, slum dog, slum dog. Listen, buddy. I want to show you something right now. I'm glad I just thought about this. Slumdog, this is very important. Listen to me, buddy. Okay, you were thinking perhaps um, Michigan. That's fine. That's fine. But I'm going to tell you something. Um, I was just out the other day with a, with a, with a um, sorry, Puget. Okay. They, they split like crazy, buddy. You're splitting hardwood, thin barked hardwood trees. I hope you watch the um, the flick technique there. That That's how I chip away a lot of that stuff when I get into it. We don't get into it a ton, but when we do, I incorporate that method like mad. Okay, here's an axe right here. Look at this thing. I want to show this to you. Look at this. Look at it. This axe right here, my friend. I think if I'm not mistaken, this is a beautiful axe got some markings on it i see a g i'll, I'll look more importantly uh, uh closer in a, in a bit but but this is some of the pugets are look at the difference here look at that look at that puget it's about three inches longer this is not a humongous puget buddy it's not a massive puget it's got great splitting capacities look it's not a skinny head you don't want a really skinny skinny cutter this has got some girth this will split like mad it will. It'll split like mad. This is a good choice for you, buddy. If you decide not to go with the Michigan, um, you know the Michigans, they're 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 all over. They're they're everywhere. Here's one right here. Here's a Michigan right here. It's a beauty, but it's a little thinner, buddy. You know. But I've also got. You know what? I'll tell you what. Here's the one I was looking at for you right now. I'm gonna show it to you. Slum dog, are you with me? I know you are. Look at this, buddy. This is what I was gonna give you right here. It doesn't have a name on it, but you know something, bud? Look at the axe head. Look at the wedge style head on it. It's sharp as, it's sharp as a tack, okay? It's short, like it, it is, it's a short little head. It's got a good, it's a good skookum strong head, but look at the, the splitting capacity it has. Do you know what I mean by that, buddy? See the wedge? This is a mean splitter. It's just not a real prestigious head, that's all. And if that means something to you, then I would maybe think about going with the Puget. You know what I mean? So I'm going to leave that with you to think about, buddy. And you can let me know. You can email. We can do whatever you want, man. I'm easy, guys. I'm super duper easy. I'm just regular Joe. You got regular Joe here. Regular Joe's got a YouTube channel that he is extremely proud of. Friends, the group of freaking people that are on this channel, the how this channel has morphed, I'm telling you right now, I could not, I, I, I couldn't fathom this program going on two and a half years ago. I couldn't imagine it. Okay. I'm, I'm being serious right now. I, I just, I'm blown away. I am blown away at, at how this channel has gone. And friends, again, you know, how I always say this. We've only just begun and it's true. It's the truth. We, we, I just, I, I love this. I love this. I, I, I could do this every day. <laughs> I do do it every day. Okay.